Agents of Shield on season four, episode fourteen. It's called The Man Behind the Shield. So, guys, last episode we got to see a character called Agnes. I was not expecting to see her. When I saw her, I was like, "Wait, is that Ada?" <laughs> that's what. That's my first thought when I saw her in the beginning, and I was kind of confused. I really thought that was another android, but then later down in the episode, they said that's the real, you know, basically Ada. It's the real person. Basically, Radcliffe, you know, and her were lovers, I guess, or something like that. Maybe they were somewhat together, and she was, I guess, trying to find out if they're a thing. But it just didn't happen like that. You know, Radcliffe basically left her, so, you know, whenever he did. Radcliffe, you know, copied her and, you know, used her, you know, look to put it on Ada. You can see how Ada was kind of jealous. The way she's looking at her, it's like she looked like she was kind of jealous of how uh, Radcliffe was treating her. And, you know, Agnes did have, like, a disease. I forgot what the disease was called, but she was dying anyway. And, you know, she was, you know, looking at death every day. Wilson was trying to convince uh, Agnes to help, you know, him to get Radcliffe. To, so he is able to, you know, try to find May. But it just, it didn't happen like that. Then Radcliffe convinced her to come, you know, come with him to, you know, in the car. To, so that we could put you in this, you know, framework in another world. So you could live pretty much happy, happily ever after. But... And, you know, basically Agnes died at the end and it just didn't happen like that. Now Coulson is aware that May is alive and now he's not going to give up ever until he finds May. And then Jeffrey Mace got captured at the end of the episode by uh, Anton or whatever, the Russian guy. I'm not sure what they're going to do to him. I don't know. I don't know if they're able to get him back. I hope nothing happens to Jeffrey Mace. I do like his character, you know, over time when you keep seeing him. I do love his character a lot. And one more thing, Ellen Nadir is dead. I, I did say in my in the last uh, video, I like I didn't really care for her. I did feel bad for her when she died by the watchdog guy that turned into an inhuman that explodes. I did not feel bad at all that she died. And then the watchdog guy that it turns into human got captured by Fitz and Gemma by this machine or whatever that, you know, when he exploded, they just drive through and then just suck up, you know, him in, in the ball. That's pretty much what they did. Yeah, I just can't wait to see this next episode, guys. So for you guys, let's check this out. Well, I'll be. Ooh. That hurt. <laughs> Right, that's enough. Oh, okay, I'm about well, to say. Unbelievable. It's like the real thing. Oh. I could even smell the sweat. But I, I felt strangely cold, though. Well, I tried to make the simulation as real as possible, and since you always leave the aircon on in the base, I exaggerated. Sir, the GPS signal we're tracking on the director's suit, we've locked in on the location. Where? Nome, Alaska. Oh, they put a GPS on his suit. That's nice, so that's good. Oh, of course, it's never that simple. Took it off. Coulson. Oh, they're really trying to get him. It's you. See the mining facility in this picture? He owns it. Purchased by Anton Ivanov this year. It's the only thing here that ties back to him. Does it tie back to you too? Yeah. Oh, we're going back. Dobro jutro. Ya tut is you in. No go secret. Just cheat up siak. Damn. If that guy doesn't have a cat, he'd be really confused. Hey, what the hell are you doing here? I didn't request a specialist. I go where I'm assigned. Wait, is he still strong? Oh, he is. <laughs> That's too easy. It's good to see there's still some fight left in you. But I should expect as much from S.H.I.E.L.D.'s inhuman director. I'm placing you under arrest in the name of S.H.I.E.L.D. With what power? Surely you have used the last of yours. He knows. What? <coughs> he's strong too? I thought he's the same stuff. Wow, knocked him out. I know you can do better than that. Clear. Well, there it is. You did this. You jinxed us. You literally willed this into existence. What? They don't cover safe cracking at the communications academy? Don't worry. I have got this 100% under. <laughs> Shut up. Don't worry. I'm good with my hands. Not how I remember it. Okay. Here <laughs> it comes. Never long before you bring that up. What? Well, I remember you fumbling quite a bit. I didn't know you that well back then. I didn't want to be presumptuous. You were undercover as my husband. Right. 
and I knew we were on camera. It took over two minutes to unhook my bra. That was an act for the camera. You know, I was, I was being a gentleman. <laughs> what, they don't cover foreplay at the Operations Academy? They teach us to commit to the mission. You do this? Not me. May. What do you think's in there? Well, we already have the suit. Let's hope it's not the director's body this time. Preparations here are nearly completed. That is nearly a satisfying report. If you're done playing with your food, there is still work to be done. My methods disturb you. Do you feel sympathy for the thing you attempt to emulate? I was programmed to observe human behavior. Yours is different. You are uh, fake, just like that man in there. And when will you be done with the director? Once he serves his purpose. Oh. The hell is this? Well, they've been dead forever. Are they ill? Agent Colton, I presume. Do you know who I am? The sick son of a bitch who kidnapped my people and seems to have more than a few skeletons in his closet. Do you not recognize these men? Should I? Yes, you should. Because you had them killed. How? Four guys at once. Should be fun. What? No. No guns blazing tactics, Rambo. We're spies, not soldiers. We do what has to be done. The mission comes before the man. You here to back me up or to retrieve the 084? Hey, what? I'll stall Stalin and the gang. You stay here, get the 084. What are you gonna say to them anyway? There's a biohazard contamination. Bio always works. <laughs> Not inspiring confidence. <laughs> oh, boy. Please tell me one of you speaks English. With the UN task force here, some biohazardous materials were unearthed on this site. Really dangerous stuff. You got paper? I do indeed. Oh, my comrades. They were my brothers. I had to dig up their bodies just to pay my respects. Where are my people? Your people will suffer the exact same fate as my unit. Wow, that's why he's doing Only it. That's why there will he's... be no one left to find their bodies. The unit has been made aware that an item was found on the premises. We have been sent to retrieve it. Ethan is this. Looks like your partner was asked to retrieve the item at any cost as well. The cost is you. This is your last chance, Director. To denounce S.H.I.E.L.D. and all that it has done. Do you have any regrets? I believe in Agent Coulson. I believe in S.H.I.E.L.D. as for all its imperfections. It strives to do the right thing. You claim to fight for others? For humanity? I think you lost yours a long time ago. To answer your question, I do have one regret. That I don't have any superpowers of my own that I could use to kick your ass. <laughs> I can respect a man who stands behind his true beliefs. Personally, I can overlook your sins. Comrades. Well, let's just say they are less forgiving than I am. room at sub basement but simmons on it davis you're with them the rest of us will fan out search this place top to bottom for director mason agent may special agent philip j colson i have waited a long time for a face to face no one left to protect you I thought the mission came before the man. Did you really think I was going to leave your defenseless ass behind? Yes, yes, I 100% <laughs> did. I let you sweat a little. You were one of the SBR agents at the mining facility. Wow, he was. That was your unit. Ah, and they were killed for not retrieving the object stolen from our soil. All of these things you've done, all of the energy spent, the hatred. And you know what the funny thing about it is? I have no idea who the hell you are. I've been on hundreds of missions in my time. This one you're so upset about, I was sent to retrieve an object. If I'm being honest, I don't even remember what it was. Me, on the other hand. I'm waiting a long time for a face-to-face. -face. Not a fair fight, but I will fight it regardless. Oh, my God. Fucking shot. Oh! 
down. Where is everybody? Man, he got really beat. <sighs> May was a uh, We're damn. too late. <sighs> well, I gathered what I could from the communications room. Who knows what the others have found? Director Mace! I've been trying to reach you. He needs medical attention. We need to get him out of here. Finally, I've been looking for you guys everywhere. Where's May? She's not here. They must have had her on the submarine. Have to keep searching. We're keep... pulling out. But, sir. We'll tend to our injured. We'll have to fight another day. How long were we in that base? Fun. The timetable of this mission is bothering me. Blast door scanner system. LMD detection. Yeah. Fitz. This has to be a mistake. Wait, wait, wait. How many? All of them. What? The plan worked. We have replaced the top operatives at S.H.I.E.L.D. Now the next phase begins. Even film has a purpose. Damn. I can't believe that they got replaced by decoys, too. Say it. No. Say it. I already did. Thank you for saving my ass back there. You're welcome. Oh, no. Phil? Waited around forever. I think that's long enough. All right, guys, this was a really good episode. So basically, like, the whole plan was to basically replace the main people on S.H.I.E.L.D. with decoys. I was not expecting that. I was I was really, like, thrown off by that because I, was, I wasn't really paying attention to that. And the episode really did a good job on, you know, you know, putting you in a certain direction where you didn't really notice it at all. And then when Simmons said, like, the timeline just seems so off and they found out they're, they're decoys, all of them. And... It's like, what, did Ada create them or did Radcliffe do it? I think obviously Radcliffe obviously created them and, you know, put them into place. It's like basically the whole plan of it. Basically, Anton did survive the, you know, when the rocks came up on top of him. I thought he would have died, but he did not. Really, Ada really wants to go through this whole plan and makes it, you know, make it, you know, happen. And she's really dangerous in this one. And I'm pretty sure, obviously, they're going to kill all the Adas off. Definitely, we're definitely not, probably not going to see her next season. I'll be really surprised if we see Ada, uh, like, next season, definitely on, like, season five. But I doubt it. I think I'd pretty much, like, at the end of it, I think they will kill her off and get rid of her because she's just too dangerous to have around. And they're definitely not going to trust Ratcliffe ever again. Ever. They're never going to do it. And, you know, Fitz is trying to basically track, you know, the framework and track where, you know, Ratcliffe is. They know that uh, May is in the submarine and they got to figure out how to get her back and definitely how to get the rest of the team back so i don't know what fitz and simmons are going to do they're going to definitely try to play along with this one while they're trying to figure out how to get the real ones back hey guys please post your comments down below to me think about this awesome episode for ages of shield if you guys enjoyed this reaction if you like the video please don't forget to sub the channel guys please check out the patreon page the full episode will be on there guys stay focused stay motivated i'll see you next ages of shield